A Yearning for Learning by Robert Drury. There are some new ideas of something impressively important that infers some encouragement to my sense of loyal support to your fine cause. I am beginning to yearn for that deference that makes a difference of those things that seem to be, to be going on that I hope to hear in reference. Of learning of everyone's total indivisibility, of new beginnings that I'll sound out, there my acceptance in the dependence on individuality that I encounter. I remember in my time the long winding trail of lessons in life's hard knocks. So I learned to keep away from frantic moves that climb over crumbling rocks. Going from bad or worse, but then slowly finding my feet to then stand on hope, knowing there's more to life than the current deals dishing out some old trope. Remembering life can be harrowing for the weakened in mind, who are pushed and blindsided every which way by easy meals that shoves a life to be shushed. Yearning to defend all, using our precious methods of mysterious madness, while we're trying to create a new world of incredible community gladness. For some seem hell-bent on hoping to blow in any kind of reasoning, in everything, even as simple as beginning to trust in anyone to believe in. A yearning for a good learning in the cooked-up ways of great trade, should I see it from inside or outside, and show the plans that are laid. Preparedness in the glorious adventuresome someone to share in the game, could mark anyone out as someone to personally set this world aflame. Learning of the lives and loves of ordinary folks on shore and, and in store should lead to a sure-footed understanding in their ways and means for sure. As the Ways and Means Committee meets regularly to surely seek and redeem every issue of need set out in the scheduled sheet to keep the street clean, I'm yearning for the love of life and not hate. People are so complicated we know. Relationships slide on the bumpy seesaw ride. Up and down, it bumps my bum's ego. Think and plan ahead, friend. You strengthen the legs to soft land every time, working together to confess the truth of love's life to smooth smile your long ride. Great learning is the great hope for the future, true, but only for the few, some say. Learning the good book is the great door to the store of knowledge and you, okay? From history to future's new ways, our lives live in the here and now and all ways. We yearn for the here and now to be the best possible in all ways that stays. A yearning we thrive, learning we strive, knowing to stand on the truth of life. Teach that each should learn those, less, those things in time, too important to deride. I stand in mourning for the loss of hope for our, our great national stature now given away of our nation's grandiose sense of its international character. Come, one and all, find a yearning for learning the great lessons in life. It's a shame to play the blame game in the shape of envy, jealousy and strife. Why lose what so few have won, for the so many to a win, for our glorious freedom? Let's learn from the Master, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. Thank you.